four values are listed below. We have a seventh, we have 20%, we have the square root of 0.5, we have the absolute value of 0.5, which list shows the values in order from least to greatest. All right, well, the thing that we need to do is we need to turn all of these into decimals, or at least that's what I would do. So let's do that. One seventh, okay, I have already in black is 0 0.14 blah, 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 blah. 20% as a decimal, no calculator needed for that one is 0.2, or I'll put 0.20 so we can keep it consistent with two decimal places. Uh, the square root of 0 0.5 is 0 0.707, so we'll say 0. Point, oh, an angel just got its wings. Uh, 0 0.71. And the absolute value of anything, it just becomes its positive self, so 0 0.5. So the smallest one of these is the first one, the one seventh. So that eliminates you and the la that, <laughs> that eliminates you. After that, we are looking at 0 0.20. So that leaves us as 20%. And then the rest is just the rest. So C is going to be my answer based off of what I have. But yeah, these first two guys are my uh, first two, least the greatest. And then 0.5. Maybe I should put 0.50 will come before 0.71. So it's just a matter of, this is a calculator section problem. It's a matter of throwing everything you can into your calculator, maybe turning it into two, two maybe three decimals, whatever works for you, and then finding out smallest to largest. That's it.